Hello everyone, my name is Arman Manohar Singh. My roll number is 21 MF3I M02 and my section is 13. This is my third DIY assignment in which I'm going to show the working of a laser mouse which is different from optical mouse as optical mouse uses LED light to detect the movement of the mouse whereas this uses laser technology which obviously is invisible to human eye and it is almost like cannot be seen by us let me show you it works properly let me this is a receiver let me plug it in as you can see the mouse is working properly now let's disassemble it I use a screwdriver to remove the screw and let me take off the upper cover the mouse. This is the plastic upper cover of the mouse which I have taken off using the screwdriver. So here is the interior part of my mouse. This is the right click. This is the left click. This is the scroll wheel. This is the power wire attached right to the battery, which is a double cell. And this is the PCB, the printed circuit board. And this right here is the IC of the laser mouse, which has CMO sensor in it. This is the main part of the laser mouse, which is Z encoder, which uses the information when we move the scroll wheel and passes to the receiver, which is directly connected to the laptop or the computer. Let me show you the rear view of the PCB this is the rear view of the PCB uh, which is obviously made of silicon this is the IC sensor uh, the IC of the, is the mouse and this right here is the LED which is laser light and like the optical mouse which is almost as i said invisible to the naked eye and now let me show you the working of the led mouse so generally laser mice work by using a laser which comes from right here to detect the hand movement like all optical mice the laser mouse has no moving parts inside laser is more accurate than the standard optical mouse precision uh, providing up to 20x greater sensitivity and precision this improved sensitivity and precision can be the key for gaming applications and graphical or engine engineering design applications where pinpoint accuracy is very important the beam emitted by the laser mouse moves with the user's hand triggering an optical sensor system. It works in tandem with a system which tracks how far the mouse has moved by bouncing hundreds of images every second, constantly updating the position of the mouse and the subsequent position of the cursor on the screen. 
Now let's assemble it, reassemble it and check the working if it works perfectly. Here goes the battery. This is the receiver. So I plugged in the receiver and just the power button, let me switch it on. Now as you can see, working fine hey friend thankfully i have not damaged my mouse so this was my di assignment 3 and thank you